Vlogs. Cost of living is on everyone's mind at the moment because everyday spending is increasing day by day and salaries stay the same. So, if you want to save more money to give boost to your budget each month, one reliable way to do is to cut your spending. To cut your spending, you might need some inspiration from me where to start this plan of saving money. Nowadays, food and grocery prices are the biggest expense of every home. So, in this video, I'm going to share some valuable tips and these tips will help you to save more money than before. When you are buying any item at supermarket, you can get a better value and save more by comparing unit prices between different brands and different pack sizes. For example, here I am going to compare two sizes of milk bottles. I am picking 3 liters of milk bottle. Now I want to see the price of 2 liters of milk bottle of the same brand. The 2 liter pack seems to be cheaper as compared to 3 liter of bottle. But if I calculate the unit price, the 3 liter of milk bottle is adding more value to my money. I generally prefer to buy refillable hand soaps and shampoos because these are cost effective and eco friendly. Here I am comparing the price of refillable hand wash and the one that is pre-filled plastic bottle of hand wash. This bottle of hand wash is costing me more. At home, I have dispensers of my choice and I refill all the pumps at home. So, in this way, this refillable hand wash is cost effective. Generic brands offer great savings as compared to the name brands often with comparable quality. Many people, whether they are at drugstore, clothing store, supermarket or makeup department, they look back and forth and try to figure out whether the generic brand is good or the popular brands. Here I am comparing the generic cashew nuts with the one that has name brand and the generic cashew nuts pack is costing me less. I am saving more money. Whether you are buying groceries online or in store, always track the discounts or promotions that the supermarket offers to its customers. Supermarkets are always running promotions that can help you save on milk, staples, bread, sweets and chocolates, and many more. You can browse their catalog to see if the item what you are after is on special discounts. In this way, you are able to decide where to spend money to save more. When I plan to buy meat, I look closely at the price tags. Sometimes I get the cuts of meat in less price and sometimes not. I always find chicken breasts to be three times more expensive than drumsticks and the whole chicken. I'm not going to buy this expensive cut of chicken. Buying the whole chicken is helping me to spend less. Most of the supermarkets offer a wide variety of washed and pre-cut fruits and vegetables. Although, these are ready for you to enjoy immediately, but you can end up paying five times more for such convenience. Here is a small pack of pre-cut and washed mixed vegetables. But if I buy these whole vegetables, these will require just 5 minutes to chop. So the whole vegetables are costing me much less as compared to the pre-cut 
vegetable pack. If you try to save at every single step, you will get an incredible saving. Nowadays, consumption of processed food is increasing as these can be cooked instantly and conveniently. On the other hand, these type of food tend to be very expensive and exert a great pressure on your wallet. So it's best to minimize intake of processed food and replace them with healthier alternatives. For example, always prefer plain yogurt instead of flavored yogurt. As flavored yogurt contains artificial colors, flavors and sweetness, you can consume plain yogurt by adding fresh fruits of your choice and a little bit honey to make it sweet if you want. Similarly, buy dry rolled oats instead of processed breakfast cereals. I consume rolled oats in this way. Take yogurt in a bowl and soak rolled oats overnight. And in the morning, I add nuts of my choice. Here's my healthy breakfast. When we shop in supermarkets, the dates on animals are mentioned such as you spy and best before. We can save much more money on food items when we will understand these two terminologies. You spy dates indicate that a product is no longer be safe to eat after this date. So you should not eat, cook or freeze after the mentioned date on the product even if it looks or smells perfectly fine. Best before dates mainly indicate the quality of product rather than its safety. An other important tip regarding consumption of food is to always follow the storage instructions on the products. Otherwise, the products may no longer be good to consume even you use before is use by date. Fresh fruits and vegetables are left for some days, most of them start to get rotten and we are urged to throw them away. But if we plan midweek shopping for fresh items rather than buying once a week in bulk, we can avoid wasting and can save more money. Always make a habit to plan meal menu in advance. Meal planning is the key to save money on food and you can stay organized with food. After planning meal, I always make a grocery list in my gadget. While shopping in supermarket, I strictly stick to this list. In this way, I can avoid for those things that I don't need. And it helps me to spend less. of saving money is very simple and I hope by following these useful tips you can get your peace of mind that will improve your life and boost your financial stability. Thank you very much.